All right, so we got X Hitman reacts to Hitman 3. Let's go right to the video. These are smart hits, and it can be done if that he guy. He looks like you. He looks like a hit hitman. That I'll be yeah, that's what I would have did. <laughs> that's the technique. <laughs> what a mess. There's nothing he can do about it. He's not even looking. Give him a quick push. He's done. John Alight. Here we are again today for Experts React. I'm John Alight, X Hitman of the Gambino okay. family. Check Gambino out Hitman family. 3. Let's I don't do know it. who that is. Uh oh, poison that drink. This is great. Anytime I see something like this, where they know somebody's sitting there, they're doing something, they're, they're vulnerable. He and said, you can This do is great. Quietly and get out of there fast, especially with drinks. If somebody's good at what they're doing, this is what they'll do. What's the kind of way? It, it would be something with a pill, with a drink, with a shot, with arsenic, or something when they're walking by you and they don't realize in the crowd. If you could do something like that, that's the way to do it now. Oh, I don't want to do nothing like that. This man giving us straight. These are all good hits. These are hits where it's done quietly and uh, without a lot of detection, keeping it very simple, without any noise, without. Uh, Y'all, he's giving us tips and so tricks. So far, uh, I really like the way that they're, they're handling this game. Again, it's good. He's in higher ground. He's up top, very quiet. Found a, a location, whether it's through a window, through a skylight, and nobody spots him, and he's out. Another a good hit. So now Ooh. I know why they call this game Assassination <laughs> Three. They're good. They they do not to good correct also, him. Also, again, it's quiet. <laughs> it's technology. You don't need to use it. Um, sorry, sir. Yeah, it's not assassin. It, it's it's it, 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 it's it's hit it's Hitman. Oh, okay. Never mind. It, it's Assassination Three. We'll we'll just we'll just tell the editor to you you know. I don't want to come come across you know, the ex Hitman. You're sorry. You know. I'll just tell the editor to, you know, <laughs> facts. <laughs> That's the act I'm putting on. Yeah, sir. It's actually a Hitman three. Yeah, it's not Assassination three. And then, like, and then, you know, if I don't, if I don't come in tomorrow, if I don't clock out, if I don't clock in tomorrow, then everybody would know why. So let me, let me just, I'll just tell the editor to correct it because yeah, I'm not correcting this dude right here. He's a menace. Gun like people think or a knife. You know, same with air conditioned systems, house systems. You have carbon dioxide that kill people silently. This man was That's an no different. hit man. That's crazy, man. Ventilation system, you gotta breathe air. So if you poison that air quality, it's a, a quiet hit. Nobody knows what happens. Very hard True. to detect and even check how they died, so. Target down. Well done. <laughs> Good hit. <laughs> He's talking about some if good hit. Quiet like that, fairly <laughs> easy to leave the crime scene because the way you got in from whatever information you got, whether you broke <laughs> alarm systems or you came in through a, a cut oh fence or through grounds that don't have a fence. Obviously, he knew what he was doing. He got in there, so whatever way he came in, he's coming out the he's same way. And if you're not man. making any noise or tripping Ooh. alarms, it's fairly easy. You got to remember that you're doing it at your pace, your time is done real well, whether it was by him or somebody counterpart. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That I didn't like. I mean, I wouldn't use a, a garrote because of DNA. Touching the body, you're leaving DNA. Picking up the body and moving, it's not necessary. Even if they're going to find her, they're going to find her in one second after that. If they come in the bathroom looking for her, they're going to look around to try to find her anyway. So it's cool scene. I just wouldn't use the technique. Wow. Oh. That also, I wouldn't use it. If you're in there already, you need to do something quiet that makes noise. If you're going to electrocute, there's going to be screaming and yelling, and there's going to be a, a shortage with the electric outlet. So I want to do that one. She did the Macarena. The boy's the biggest bounty you see. In the wrong world, you don't really get a bounty on somebody, but in the street, you do. The hits that I've seen in Europe where they're offering up to two million with guys, and I think that's realistic depending on what the guy is doing and what kind of money he's making. So they do offer him up 100,000. Oh is usually a number you hear from different hits around the world and different places. It's not unrealistic to see that kind of money being. Bro, imagine like you got beef with somebody, bro, and and and, and a dude that you got beef with, bro. He's like, you know what? I'm gonna just give a hundred thousand to the homies. I'm gonna just give a hundred thousand to the boys and let and let them and let them do what they gotta do. That is scary, bro. I'm gonna just get. I'm gonna just give two million to the boys. <laughs> I'ma just get to I'ma just give three million to the boys. Go ahead. Yep, mm -hmm, yep, yep. Oh yeah, it's in y'all account. Yep. Bring the clip back empty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy, bro. That, that not the clip back empty part. No, nah, that's OD. But like the bro, no, bro. That's crazy, bro. Imagine bro, that's yes. crazy. Target down. 
That's what I was saying earlier. See, it's quiet, it's fast, it's one movement, and you're out. Oh Something like God. that is realistic. And for Ooh. the game itself, it's pretty cool. I would never move the body again. Doesn't make really? sense. He's dragging yeah, blood anyway, yeah. and that blood's yeah. gonna come across the room. They're gonna come in looking for it anyway. Yeah. DNA, I wouldn't touch it. This man giving us this. Oh, and the knife, if you're a knife expert, yeah, it's good. If you're not a knife expert, just go up to the body. You're there anyway. It's five more steps. And if it's the time of the th time of the essence thing, this you're going up there and dragging tips, the body anyway. So you might as well just get up close. Hopefully um, he again, still doesn't do it. It's do something this. different. It's, I like it. I mean, it's action. It's moving. It's fast. I like it. Okay. You know what? He's not bad. You know what? I'm going to explain why. Glycerin, I mean, if there's several targets, no different than throwing a small grenade or something, and you want to hit three or four people, yeah, it's good. But as far as if you're trying to get in and out of there quietly and there's other security, it's bad. But for the game purpose, it's another way to assassinate somebody. It actually would be used somewhere if there's several people that you got to hit at once. You would mm -hmm. use some sort of bomb. It's pretty good. Target down. Ooh. Well done, 47. I don't know if that's throwing a, a star or something like that, but if you miss the target, it's a problem. She's going to scream and yell, and she had security right there, so I'm not with throwing anything. You're there. You might as well do it the right way while you're there, but just, you don't leave it to chance. Drowning's a good way. It's quiet. In this thing, it's, she gave a little yelp. If you catch him unsuspecting and you get him in the water immediately, if you overpower him, which you can, it's a lot stronger, there wouldn't be any noise. Oh my god, man. Target down. Ooh. To me, these are perfect hits. I'm not a sniper, but I got friends that are snipers that are, you know, in armed forces. So if you're across another building and, uh, and say it's not occupied and you can get into another apartment and, and hit somebody like that, and you're an expert, it's very, very hard. They just did that hit actually in Europe about two years ago. Somebody was an expert sniper and they wore women's clothes and heels and went into a building on a rooftop and hit three guys. It's still done and if you're that good, and there's a lot of snipers that are that good, great way to hit somebody and not get caught. Target down. Bruh. Well done, 47. <laughs> I'm not so much for throwing Do anybody off the top of me unless it's it 10 up. stories or better. Also because of the noise factor, also because you're upstairs, you got to come down. So True. if there's not that many exits to leave from, uh, they can cover those exits if they have a lot of security quickly. If you knew somebody's going to touch that railing every day or lean on it, yeah, it's good. The odds of getting somebody to do that every day and know they're going to do that and not somebody else, uh, then they know that there's oh going to be a hit on it. If somebody else leans on that or, or dies from that, not the person that you tended. So I'm well, not for that hit either. But for the game, it's a good hit. It's scary and it's unique. So it was cool in its own way. Yes. Good. If they were going to do it like that and they're walking with him anyway and he's still going to use a gun, should have just shot him right while he's standing. And yeah. Why am I agreeing? Wait, no, 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 no. I mean, no. Ooh. I don't know what that was. If he was involved and he was security for him, and, or he snuck in and did that. So if he's security for him, I understand the kill like that because that's his opportunity. It doesn't matter because he's security with them inside. But if he snuck in and did that, again, he's on an upper level. He's got to get out. He's this yelling going on. Too much time to get out of the building. It gives all the security to be able to catch him. So I'm not for that. Bro. Uh oh, yep. Hang up, yep. Oh, we just push them. He's in there. Yeah. He's in security with them anyway. Just walk up to him and push him. Unless you're a complete expert with that knife, it's not necessary to do it that way. Yeah, that's what I would have did. <laughs> I said Menace. earlier, right? So that's the technique. If you're gonna, he's there. He's there's nothing he can do about. It. He's not even looking. You give him a quick push. He's done. What I said earlier, I guess they makes sense. They yeah, have the same opinion. Again, he's taking things to chance. He shot if he misses the shot. If the timing's not right, the speaker don't fall at him. If you're going to use the gun, why you just shoot him anyway? So I would just use yeah. the gun. If that's what they're going to do, but not that. That, again, is for a real hits ridiculous. But for a game, it's just something different. So I get it. Yeah. Uh oh. Yep. Uh -oh. This is a good hit, again, because this is new technology. Uh, if you know he's the one that's going to eat that food and you poison it or his drink, there's nothing he can do about that, and it's 100% you got him. What, what is he eating, by the way? And the team is involved, obviously. Everybody's there. 
I mean, raw steak when poison it depends on what the situation is. You know, if somebody's in a bar and they're drinking, you don't want it to be quick. You want them to drink the drink, doesn't feel well, and meanwhile the poison's we working, and they got to go back. There's maybe no more cameras of whoever was in there. Uh -huh. You don't want them to know exactly when it happened. So in this situation, it looks like it's an inside job from everybody sitting there. Maybe it's not. So I wouldn't want it to be poison like arsenic like that quick. You'd yeah. want it slow acting, two days, three days, four days. Yeah, that's how Somebody long he was up top knew he was coming there and they cut that line somehow or they knew he was going to stand that's how there long be a little poison more can just sit in there until like, it takes effect again. you're taking it Yo, to chance crazy, you're taking bro. that he's not going to move you're taking it that that one shot is going to make that come down you got him 47 Ooh. i love these hits like that with a little more intelligence because those are realistic if you know somebody's parachuting all the time and you jimmy his parachute where it's not going to work or a double parachute it can be done and it's done in a smart way and no one can really prove it on top of that it'd be hard to prove if you're smart on the way you did it so i, I like those kind of hits brings you back into a, a new era oh these are smart hits if you're able and you're a bomb savvy savvy guy you know how to put one together and a little bomb like that yeah it's kind of cool because it's something different and it can be done if that guy you know he's gonna hit that ball every day we got bro thought he was roy mcelroy final thought is i like this game actually i thought it was it was well done they had a lot of different things in it i like the way they brought it across so i i would play this game i enjoyed this one thank you everybody right. check us out and johnelite.com on my website my instagram true john elite for more experts reacts check out gameology all right shout out to john elite man um bro okay all right one thing i wanted to say about him was i like this i've seen a bunch of videos where you know uh for instance um I've, I've seen a video where an ex uh marine whatever was like reacting to call of duty or i would see like let's uh for example i would see like a tennis player react to like a tennis game or any any stuff like that right I've seen a bunch of those videos where, like, uh, a, a person of, like, a real profession will, you know, watch, you know, uh, or not, well, yeah, will watch or react to, like, you know, um, like, the game. that But, like, they do it in real life, and obviously the game is obviously fake. Um, in this situation, I like that. I like that he took into consideration that it was a video game. Uh, and all the videos that I was watching, uh, for instance, like the like an ex army person reacts to uh, Call of Duty, whatever, they would take it so seriously. Oh, I'm not gonna do that, Doug. If I was him, I would have pulled out my 16 Magnum, but then do that, and then and then shoot this, and then jump off of this, and then, you know, like sometimes they take it a little bit too seriously. With him, um, he was just, you know, I, I like that he was considering that it was a game. You know, he didn't take it too seriously. Um, that's what like I was like nodding my head saying mm hmm because after he was saying oh you know I, I wouldn't do that why didn't he just shoot him blah 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 and then he would say immediately right after he would say you know but it was cool because you know it's it because it, it's you know it's in the game so uh, that's actually pretty cool that that that's really that's really why uh why I like this because he didn't really take it too seriously so other than that comment down below what you guys think about this um I think I did I play Hitman three I think I I think I played I don't I don't know. I, but I think I, I played like the first mission where I get off the boat and I was like walking towards like that house in the middle of nowhere and like on, on like the on like a Mr. Beast Island, whatever. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. Well, other than that, I uh, hope you guys did a video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video if you guys like my reaction. Other than that, I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out and.